some action from Tuesday. Mexican international Chucky Lozano getting the start for Napoli in a 4-2 win over Ajax, an Ajax team that featured both Edson Alvarez and Jorge Sanchez. Chucky played 77 minutes and scored a beauty, I mean a beauty of a goal, uh, just four minutes in. A real shame that we can't show it to you. Lozano now has goals in back-to-back -back games for Napoli, who are through to the round of 16 in the Champions League and currently sit first in Syria. Herc, now that he's heating up, is Chucky Lozano Mexico's best goal threat for the upcoming World Cup? Seb, he may be Mexico's only goal threat for the upcoming World Cup. Now, I say this on a world's level, okay? Because if you look at the rest of the world, recognizable Mexican players, you ask anybody around the world, hey, who's a recognizable Mexican player? Today, they're probably gonna say, oh, Chicharito, Chicharito. <laughs> That's a reality. Yeah. Now, when you look at players who have done something at the world's level on this Mexican national team, well, it's Chucky Lozano. Mm. Ch Chucky Lozano's the one actual player on this roster that scored a World Cup goal. Chucky Lozano, okay, listen to Chucky Lozano and what he's done since mid-September. He scores a goal against Peru. Happened to be his first goal in eight months. And since then, those 18 days, goal versus Peru, two goals, one in the Serie A, one in the Champions League, and an assist. Three goals, one in assist. Mm. He's heating up, and he's heating up at the right time, and Mexico needs him to heat up because this Mexican national team today, no Raul Jimenez, no Tecatito, maybe Henry Martin could be your answer, but if you ask the world, hmm. I mean, is Henry Martin the answer? It's yeah. got to be Chucky Lozano. Yeah, Chucky is back, baby. I think that's, that's the bottom line here, right, is that Mexican fans should be very excited. It's probably the best news Mexican fans have had, at least around the attack of this team. Uh, in the last, I don't know, 12, 18 months. That's how long it's been since you really felt good about anybody scoring within this group. You can go all the way uh, back to qualifying. And it's not just hurt the goal against Ajax. As you mentioned, it's, it's the goal in Syria. It's the goal for Peru. But the goal against Ajax, to me, is something very, very sweet and something we haven't seen recently from Chucky Lozano. It's an instinctive play, and it's a beautiful goal. And you see his quickness, not just in terms of his physical quickness, his quickness in terms of his speed of thought. That's the Chucky Lozano that was a decisive difference-making player. And I think, frankly, since the Gold Cup injury, we have not seen him be that player. So to see him do it and do it on this stage was very exciting. But I, and I hate to do this, I have to agree with you. Uh, as I'm trying to think of like who else might be competing with Chucky for El Tri's biggest scoring threat, I'm like, well, it's not him, it's not him, it's not him. I mean, I got basically down to Henry Martin. I mean, it's, and, and, that's not really a knock on Henry Martin, but I don't really see him playing all that much the way things are going right now. So, I mean, the, it, it is really like, it is it is basically Chucky, no the es más, but Chucky los demás when it comes to the attack. And that's that, Herc, for me, is a real concern for two reasons. One, because Chucky Lozano, if you know he's the only guy you have to worry about at the international level, you can lock in on him. What does that, one, do to his productivity? And two, can he last? Right, because we've seen everywhere he's gone, in Europe, in Mexico, he's always one of the most fouled players in the league and his health is always a concern. So if the other team can just focus on Chucky Lozano, that's a really big problem for Mexico. Napoli doesn't have that problem. There's a million scoring threats for Napoli. With Mexico, that's not the case and that's my worry. Yeah, I think another worry is Chucky Lozano's in Europe. So you know he will stay active till then. You have mm. to bank on Henry Martin if he's gonna be the mm. man, the starter at the Great nine point. position. Mm -hmm. To stay active, Till then, it's a double-edged sword here. Uh, Santi Jimenez hasn't established himself in Tata mm -hmm. Martino's eyes. Uh, Alexis Vega, he's already on vacation. Uh, Diego Linus can't get off the bench at Braga. There's some real problems with Tata Martino on the offensive front. Yeah, by the way, on the Chucky Lozano front, the rumor mill is starting to pick his name back up again. I don't know if you saw it. Uh, Marca reporting there's some Bundesliga and Premier League interest. So we'll see uh, where that goes. Maybe not for the winter, uh, maybe for next summer should he leave Napoli. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.